just before this starts, I'm sorry about the, uh, not the video, the audio in the videos. In the last two videos, I think it was. Yeah, last two videos. Um, I don't know what happened. It was a new software that I was using that I got for free. And it was kind of a trial version as well. And it kind of fucked up on me. And I do not have it anymore because I deleted it and it was pretty shit. So I'd be going back to using Lightworks and probably some uh, movie maker if I'm doing mo funny moments. Then probably copy them over to Lightworks. And yeah, that is it. And let's get into this video. What is up my original bagels? And welcome to some probably some Call of Duty gameplay. Hopefully it is anyway because this is kind of more or less about Call of Duty. So, as you already guys know by the title of this video, this is hashtag Rostermania part 2. So, if we start off with a sensor, or face sensor, he will be teaming with Apathy and Saints, and they will be looking for a fort. But, take in mind that this team will not be under the organization phase. Sorry about that. Because there is a new rule that, that has been implemented for Call of Duty Black Ops 3 that each organization can only have one team because to be honest it's kind of not fair having two teams just kind of shows up the rest of the organization saying oh look at them they're money whores and everything they can afford two teams and yada yada all that shit but probably they'll probably go under another org like Prophecy or something or go to Red Reserve which is another part of FaZe but I don't know if it's a part of phase. Will they be able to? But anyway. Uh, TK. Um, picked up Goonjar. So back to the old TK squad. That they found success with in Black Ops 2. And of course Call of Duty Ghosts. Elevate then broke up. because Well mainly because TJ Haley could not compete in Worlds. Because he's not the right age. Then we... Rise Nation announced that Octane, Slacked, Classic and Looney are now back or are now on Rise. Uh, this should be a good team with already chemistry between Slacked and Classic and Looney rejoining Rise Nation and Octane already just good basically. So Looney went from Envy back to Rise and Slacked from Elevate, then Classic from Denial, uh, then with Looney's departure from Envy, that left Envy looking for a, busy a fourth, but instead they just dropped their, their three players, and they actually picked up, they actually kept Jacob, and picked up Slasher, X, and they would be looking for one, with, Mark as a potential fort and to be honest I think this team will do good if Aix actually performs well because you can see that if Aix performs well he does really really good and the team really does good but if he doesn't they don't perform well moving on then Spacely was left looking for three on Team Justice and he picked up John, Proofy and Replays ah uh, you know this this team Replays have replays such a good player, Proofy. John, you know, John does good when John was did good anyway when it was kind of the SB team, him, Fizzer. Um, oh, who else was it? I can't think of who else actually it was on that team, but he kind of did good on that team. Then DT Esports or Dream Team Esports announced that they are going to have a roster consisting of Sender, Chino, Diabolic and Watson. This team could do good, you know, they just picked up Chino, Diabolic and Sender, really good players and Watson, such a good player as well. Then E6 announced that they will be picking up Burns for their 18s plus team, their pro division team and their roster will be consisting of Burns, Dido, Silly and will be looking for a fort. So by the time I'm making this video, they will not have a fort. So who does that kind of leave the potential the teams that are either looking for one or are going to try and build up a team like Denial and Elevate will? 
or anybody like that, you know, that kind of leaves uh, a lot of free agents who are parasite, felony. Fizzerp is kind of a free agent. He says he he is on a team, but not, and is actually officially announced. So I'm putting him down as a free agent. Lawless, Anticity, Pac Man, Lama God, Mochilla, Royalty, Lacefield, Fears, Wheats, Exib, Proofy, TCM, Ivy, and Sinful. So if we actually look at this, um, and actually just just take um face sensors team whatever it's going to be called sensors team apathy and saints that's already two two three slayers an obj and two slayers basically so you know they could pick up um pac-man <laughs> i know i'm only messing but pac-man they could pick up pac-man but i don't think they really will they'll probably pick up mochilla i think that'll be the best bet for them because Mochilla is just so dominant with a ball and he's just such an AR based player and he's just so good with an AR. Um then if we look at Envy, if we look at Envy, they already have an AR, slasher and AX, and if they have Merc, that's an OBJ, so two uh J Cap AR, Slasher and AX, SMGs and Merc OBJ. But if Merc doesn't you know, I don't know, they could, uh, that's a hard one, they could pick up uh, royalty, but I don't think that will happen. You never know, they might pick up uh, Fizzerp, or no, jeez, not Fizzerp, sorry, Parasite, I think, yeah, Parasite, and put him as a, as OBJ, you never know, you never know, that could work, but I don't think they'll probably do that. Um, then the rest... Uh, Lawless could go to a lower team. Sinful as well. Fears, Wheats, Proofy. Ooh, Proofy is... So the kind of the main people that stand out to me is Wheats, Lama God, Mochilla, Royalty, Proofy, Ivy and Sinful. And, you know, Lama God, he's just such a good player in AW. If he can... If he can keep that going in in Black Ops 3, then he will be a really good player. Same with Mochilla and Royalty. And, of course, Proofy. Proofy's just been good in every game title anyway of Black Ops or of Call of Duty, sorry. So, you know, he should get a good team, him, Mochilla, Royalty and Proofy. Lamb and God, they should all get a good team. Um could see e6 pick up lama god maybe because you'll have them three you'll have them three core three players dido silly and lama god all that play together and they all did so good but you never know could be royalty maybe i honestly have no clue but yeah that is it guys i hope you like favorite and subscribe and i kind of went on a little rant as well and peace